Hey guys, Rorius here. Welcome back to Marvel Skies. So, we played through all the beginner stuff in the previous episode. There's actually tons of levels, and there's a community level section here. But we started- we were just about to start the intermediate when we stopped last time. So, let's get into them. Snakes and Ladders. It's the first one, apparently. <laughs> yeah, so there's actually community uh, levels in this. I wonder if it has like the- yeah, I'm assuming it has Steam Workshop integration. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh dear. <laughs> this is a little rough. I was saying in the previous episode, this game reminds me a lot of Cooler World. Like, it's like a more live-action version of Cooler World. I mean, Cooler World is live-action too, but... <laughs> when I say live-action, I mean like, active button presses. But I, what I mean is this is like... This ha you have full 3D control, whereas in Cooler World you can only move in sort of like a singular directions. Yeah, so all of this- this game uses freaking Stevia Sphere music. I recognized it as soon as it started playing, but I, was, I wasn't sure if it was. I was like, this sounds a lot like Stevia Sphere. <laughs> uh, Stevia Sphere is the artist that made- or she got went by Glacier in the- I think it's a she. Might have just misgendered. I like froze for a second there because I was like, I was like wait, <laughs> I don't know that for certain. Uh, yeah, they made the song that I used to use for my outro called Dolphin. In the hammock. That was in the hammock album. Yeah, the their music is really cool, and I would definitely recommend checking their stuff out. Oh, I didn't realize this was a gem level. Uh, um, so it's, yeah, it's fascinating to see that <laughs> the music's been used in this game. Oh. And what's interesting is it's, it's Creative Commons 3, so as long as you give credit, they don't, she doesn't mind. I keep mis I keep not sure of gendering. Uh, um, uh, yeah, so as long as you give credit, they don't mind you using their music. Uh, oh. So I wonder if that's why, oh, I wonder if that's why the music's used in this. Because, uh, <laughs> it was accessible. Get up on here. Up on here. <laughs> this is tough. Ugh. Ugh, oh, okay. Uh. Let's step back and then go, uh, no, 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 land on it, perfect, okay. These are rough, <laughs> these gem locations. No, <laughs> oh, shit, there's one up there, maybe I can go to it easily. If I just go over here, yeah, it looks relatively straightforward. But yeah, this, the, the, the but yeah, the music in, uh, the, the music that Stevia Sphere has made, really cool, I love how, I love the sort of chill, it's got real, like, Pull Blues vibe. There's actually a- I believe there's a- one of the songs is actually called Pull Blue- one of the albums is called, uh, Pull Water Blue, I think? Pull Water Blues. Uh, but yeah, there's a, like a genre. I, I- I think of it as being like a genre of music that's like- that I would- that I would call, like, Pool Blues or Holiday Blues. Um, where it's like- it sounds like music that you'd hear at the beach or at a- at a pool, at a swimming pool or whatever. Um, but it has like a melancholy feel to it. And I actually really love that kind of music. It, it makes me, it's, it's, it's cool, but I don't like to listen too much, to too much of it because it gets, uh, overwhelming sometimes. I wouldn't say that Dolphin, uh, was one of those songs, but it has, it has some elements of it, I think. Okay, let's get the checkpoint. Oh, I already got the checkpoint, didn't I? Yeah, I did. I think you keep your gems if you die, so... Yeah. I don't think I can get up there. Where's the last gems? There's two gems somewhere and I cannot see them. Are they back? Are they down here, maybe? Let's just hop down. There is one down here. Okay. Okay. Gimme, gimme, gimme. This way? Oh, so close. <laughs> Let's try again. Let's hop across there. I think maybe it's over there. It's not over here. Ugh, damn it. Where the hell is it? <laughs> Where's the last gem? No. I mean, I'm not getting a good anything for time. But that's alright. I don't really care. Can I maybe get up here? Well, 
I can't see it. I can't see where I gotta go. This is a pretty rough level to be like, what, the second level in the intermediate section? <laughs> Ooh. No, I think it's more than that, but... Oh god, it's only in the intermediate difficulty, but I, I cannot, for the life of me, find the last gem. Oh, it's, it's right there! God damn it! Uh, <laughs> to think the last episode was like, only like 17 to 20 minutes long. This whole level has been five minutes, nearly six minutes. <laughs> Oof. Alright, seven gems. These are the hard ones, the ones where you gotta find the gems around the level. They're hardest. The end is right here. <laughs> but I need the gems. Bring me the crystals! <laughs> this level is called Rough Terrain. Yeah. Sorry, I just <laughs> I was briefly possessed by Cortex. Okay. I'm doing better, I think, with finding them in this level than I was in the previous one. There's a gem up there. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going for any prize, any uh, time prizes <laughs> with these ones. Okay, I see one of the gems over on the other side. Whee! Oh! <laughs> oh! There we go. <laughs> that, was, that was rough. Ah! No! <laughs> no! Thankfully I keep my gems if I don't restart. If I don't hit R, then I keep all my gems. But I also keep my time. But that doesn't matter. <laughs> I don't care about time. See, there's a bit of a trick to do with the physics that you can get, like, good speed and... Oh, that's the last gem. Cool. You can get some pretty good speed if you jump right. If you jump correctly. Oh, damn it. Actually, it would have been faster to just let myself be killed. And then, uh, <laughs> start back at the spawn. That's probably the pro strat for that level. For speed, for, like, time and everything. Okay, this is straight up a get-to-the-end level. Okay. <laughs> This level, oh, that's probably why there's a freaking uh, community maps and stuff like that. Oops, get the checkpoint. Probably why there are community maps for this game, because I was going to say, this game totally would lend itself well to uh, have it, like being able to have like a, an editor that you could make levels really nice and easy in, um, compared to some other games, you know. Uh, so yeah, that, that's probably why there's a, that's probably why there are maps for this game. Community maps. Okay. I'm gonna guess that the uh uh, uh, <laughs> uh <laughs> I was gonna say I'm guessing that this the dark colored path is probably gonna be the harder path but I think they're just intertwining paths <laughs> yeah best try okay this looks cool Wee! Oh god! <laughs> I was trying to use a strategy that was getting me good speed before. Well. Well, shit. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Okay, wait, wait, no, restart, restart. <laughs> I'm not accepting that. Yeah, we're just gonna go straight forward. No, uh, sideways movement. <laughs> Where am I going? Oh, down here. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> I didn't know what I was supposed to do. Uh. Okay. All right, all right. We're good. We're good. Eh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Good speed. Hundred gems. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> I mentioned it in the previous episode, like, I, this is not my normal kind of game that I would play on the channel. Uh, and I don't know 
if these kind of games are as entertaining to watch. Just because I don't know what I'm doing most of the time. I'm just like going, yee, oh yee. <laughs> but uh, I hope there's some, there's some like curiosity, like this is a weird game. Why is Rory playing this game? Let's check this out. Kind of factor to it. <laughs> yeah. So it's, hopefully it's still entertaining. Oh, cool. 100 gems. Nice. Okay. What's this level called? Curved Lines. Is it, oh, there's another Stevia Sphere song. Wait. Is this the song that I'm thinking of? I wonder what this song is. I know I have it. I've heard it. <laughs> but I don't remember what what actually the song is. There we go. I'll have to check in my library. <laughs> in my musical library. Because it's a cool song. Yes, yeah, it's definitely one of the ones I have. I think I've used it in a video before. It's a cool song. It's super chill. And this is the, this is the, I think this is the Beats to Procrastinate by album. That album is super cool. It's super, super chill, but it doesn't have that, like, it's not the Paul Blues sort of style. It's the, uh, it's got like a, it's just like a chill at home kind of quiet, calm feeling to it. And I, I love music that is chill because I'm, my mood is heavily affected by the music I listen to. And music that just makes me chill just greatly helps with, like, stress and stuff like that. So I like listening to this kind of music. I like, like, banging songs and, like, super hardcore electric guitar and stuff like that and hyper distortion and I like... Oh, that was a checkpoint, not the end. <laughs> I like thumping techno beats and stuff like that, but... I also just love having a nice chill piece like this. I mentioned this in the previous episode, I think. Oh, it, it's great to have some like chill games like this to play on the channel every now and then. Just cause it, I don't know, it's just so, it's so nice to just be able to relax for a bit. <laughs> not have to worry, not have to think about anything. We'll try and get to the end of the intermediate levels section, but uh, if I find myself getting frustrated or whatever, <laughs> I'm not afraid to to cut it early. And I'm probably only gonna, gonna play a couple of episodes of this on the channel, so no, no. Uh... Oh, that's the end. So we'll go that way later. No uh, commitment or anything. Just some chill, some chill vibes and some marble skies. <laughs> What's out here? Okay, let's take it easy. Let's not fly off the handle or off the level. <laughs> what is it with me doing those wordplay thingies? Recently, I've become way more pun filled, and I don't know why or how. <gasps> uh, but I've been finding myself making puns and shit way more frequently. <laughs> okay, oh no! No! Eh. Okay, where is the last one? Ugh. It's not on any of these, no. Oh, I might be near the end. It might be on that long, long path that way. Okay, let's go for it. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> those, are, those are the noises of this game. <laughs> it's funny because I keep talking about how chill this game is. And then I keep finding myself going... <gasps> as I like nearly fall off the edge. <laughs> it's the right level of stressful though. Oh. Oh. <laughs> cool. So you can use those not only as an obstacle, but also as a, a, uh, a mechanic, I guess. Oh, Because it works upwards as well as horizontally. 
That's neat. Oh, no! Damn it! Shit! <laughs> I'm doing so well! Oh, let's just do it carefully! There we go. <laughs> yeah, turn into old man Rory. Uh, keep turning into old man Rory where I <laughs> get the rasp voice. Uh. Oh, no! You piece of shit! Ah! Uh, <laughs> I'm just gonna restart. It was right at the beginning again. <laughs> that was super rude. Let's just jump up. <laughs> Let's not use the bumper. Oh, god damn it! Shit! <laughs> I keep making silly mistakes. This is like the perfect game for that chill music. Oh, uh, no! Come on, there we are. Perfect. Now let's jump off to the right a little bit. There we are. And then uh, just bang into that wall. <laughs> yeah! Sweet! Oh, I still got a bad time. <laughs> You're gonna have a bad time. I don't even know what the like good time is. I just know that when I get 20 points, you know. <laughs> uh, what just what just happened in the background? I don't know what just happened in the background, but something went bloom. <laughs> I was like, <gasps> what's happening? But uh, apparently, it's fine. Oh god. Eh. Oh, I went to the lower path. <laughs> Shit. I don't know if this has unlockables like Marble Blast does. But uh, Marble Blast had some areas where if you went outside the main... Like, outside of the intended area sort of thing, you could get uh, upgraded. You could get, like, um, skins for your ball and... Uh, like, trails or something? I forget exactly what the deal was. Yeah, just having little extras like that is nice in these kind of games. Especially if you just earn them by playing the game, you know? It's interesting, the momentum is slowly making me go backwards. <laughs> oh, no! Wait, is that backwards? It wasn't backwards. This is another Stevia Sphere song. I wonder if it's all Stevia Sphere or if, if it's uh, just that I only recognize half of it sort of thing. Because <laughs> I could definitely see that being the case. I don't have all her music and I haven't listened to all. I keep saying her. I don't know if it is a her. Oh, we're, this is the same path that was traveling before. I didn't realize we were racing it. Oh, no, no, <laughs> God damn it. Shit, that's tough. It's hard to tell when it's coming, because there's no glass. Yeah, there's another song that I've used before. It's really cool. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. The thing is, like, the, the videos that I know that are claimed by, like, a, a misunderstanding uh, of Stevia Spheres, like, I'm not really bothered by that fact, because honestly, I wish that at the time that I had, was using them, I wish that I was able to afford to, you know, to pay Stevia Sphere for their music, because the music's really cool. So I'm not even bothered, you know? <laughs> if somehow that video that's claimed uh, gets good revenue at some point, because it was, it was, I was using it when I wasn't even earning anything, um, if that video somehow becomes more popular and gets a bunch of revenue. Um, it's all good if it, if it goes to, if it went, went to them, if it went to Stevia Sphere, I'd be fine, but I'm pretty sure it just goes straight to their label. Uh, which kind of sucks. That's what, that's the thing, is that all the musicians who are fighting, who fight for copyright protections and stuff like that, to protect their music, it's not usually, like, they're, they're confused? Damn it. They're usually confused because it's not their music that that, um, it's, sorry, it's not their, it's not really harming them much, it's, it's more harming their label. Uh, cause musicians don't make a hell of a lot of music after the, like, CD sales and stuff like that, or after, like, direct sales. 
I don't know. For, for, I, don't, I don't know a hell of a lot about the music industry, but I do know that I've seen, I've seen people talking about it before, and how, essentially, like, people like Taylor Swift or Lars Ulrich protecting his music, what he's really protecting is the, the revenue being brought in for their label that they're signed with. Like, any sort of loss of revenue from pirating and copyright infringement stuff, like, that doesn't affect them very much. They, does, they wouldn't see much of that money anyway. It's more their label that gets affected. And so, like, their label has convinced them, the, those musicians, that they need to fight to protect their own music, but it's really they're just convincing them to fight for the label, you know? I don't know. That's just what I'd heard. That's just what I had interpreted from... Oh, that was a checkpoint. Let's just keep going. We're not gonna die, right? <laughs> Right? <laughs> right, guys? Oh. Yeah, we're good. We're good. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sweat dripped <laughs> down my face. Okay. Let's go up here. Uh, let's try and get this, do this relatively quickly. I say relatively, and compared to the previous gym levels. A game like this wouldn't be too hard to make in Unity. It'd be pretty easy, in fact, to make. Uh, it'd be neat to try. Need to get, give it like a, have it give it go, give it a go, and and see how it goes. Okay, we're going high first and then low. It's definitely the longest path. Getting to the top ones. No. Oh. Let's get a, get all these. In fact, I think I have to go down again, don't I? Do I? Yeah, there's a there's a pit down here, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. Let's just go down. Ugh. Let's take the the rough path up. It's <laughs> it's more achievable than the slick path. Okay, and now full speed rolling. Uh. <laughs> Those are the rough ones. Those, I mean the. They're the slick ones, they're the hard ones to go up. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I got a hundred gems. So I did that really quickly then. <laughs> Yay. Yeah. Oh, this is called momentum. So I guess the idea is you've got to keep your momentum. Avoid the obstacles. Keep your momentum. Oh. Okay, let's just stop. <laughs> and let's get around here. Damn it, I tried to jump. I failed. There we are. Oh. Damn it. Shit. I'm not gonna get a particularly good score, I don't think, for this level. <laughs> oh no, I did! I got a good score! <laughs> yes. Uh, Alright, no gems, just straight goal. Ooh, this is like a little castle. Oh. <laughs> Shit. Uh, yeah. Can I use that to get up there? Nope. <laughs> Shit. Alright, let's just go the normal way. Oh. Is there any point in coming in here? There is none. Well. <laughs> it's, eh. Trick point. There we are. Oh. If you keep jumping, like, you, you get an interesting sort of speed boost from it. You just hold spacebar. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, get the chicken wing. Okay. I saw this ahead and I was like, oh, <laughs> I don't want to not get that. Oh, you could totally get to the end via that. You could totally get to the end really quick. Oh. <laughs> Shit. I didn't want to press R because I didn't want to start from the beginning again. Oh, there we go. You can totally get to the end by shooting up here. Yep, there we go. <laughs> Imagine if I'd done that first try. Shit, man. Okay. Seven gems, okay. Uh... <laughs> I was just about to go, Bring me the crystals! <laughs> oh, Cortex. 
You're so funny. Okay, I need that jump for later. I think. I think I need it for later. I don't know, do I actually need it? Oh, it gives you a jump here as well. Hmm. Oh, it's raining in real life now. God damn it, it's become really stormy recently. Like, raining all the time and super windy. I.e. noisy. Like, that's the thing. Someone in the stream the other day was saying, like, oh, dude, uh, th they heard me complaining about the rain and they were saying, oh, am I the only person who likes the rain? I love rain. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> I actually love the rain. Uh, the problem is, is that it, I've, since I've started recording, I've, since I've started doing YouTube, uh, you know, whenever I'm recording, I need this to be, I need the room to be quiet, but we have a loud roof. <laughs> we have a roof that, when the rain hits it, makes a lot of noise. Okay, there we go. So, um, it's not good when it's raining, you know, it's, it's, it's rough. It's the same with, like, someone's building nearby, or if, uh, like, animals are running around on the ceiling like it's it's just any noise this, this room is not well sound insulated unfortunately i wish it i wish i could sound insulate it better i have some uh sound in insulation foam but it's unfortunately i don't have enough of it firstly it's expensive <laughs> it's expensive stuff i don't have enough of it and uh I didn't want to glue it to the wall, so I've been using it just sort of generally around the room. Oh, oh, is that enough? Is that enough? I think it is. Yeah. Oh, almost bullseye. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, that's the end. That's the end of intermediate. So yeah, it took me about 10 minutes longer than the previous one. Uh, yeah, so let's... <laughs> I, once again, I pressed next level, so I immediately started the advanced levels. Uh, but yeah. If you want to see me play more of this, let me know, because I'm willing to play the advanced ones. And there's two bonus levels sections as well, so we could potentially have, you know, five episodes of this, just of the main game. Uh, but yeah, let me know what you think, because <laughs> I enjoy the shit out of this. And maybe I will return to it just if I feel like chilling out for another, for another video session, you know. So, we'll leave that there. If you like what you saw, hit like. If you want to see more from me, then subscribe. <laughs> if you have any other games that are like little games like this, that are chill and still entertaining, but just, you know, not too stressful. <laughs> Let me know, because I'd be keen to play them. Uh, but yeah, until the next thing I play as main series, uh, thank you so much for watching, and until next time. <laughs> <laughs>